Hello everyone, and thank you for joining me here. My name is Mr. Mocha Lover, and let us continue playing as Fascist Poland. So, first thing I noticed in 1943, we got a lot of air experience. Holy crap. And this is looking terrible. This is absolutely going terrible for us as Poland. Uh, let's see, you got eight divisions up there. That's, you know what, we're going to keep eight guarding that or Oh, I guess we'll call it four, really. Let's take two, and they'll guard... Oh, no. Right here. And take two, and guard... Oh, maybe... Mets. I believe we should be able to take these guys out eventually. Eventually. But holy crap, we are out of a lot of supplies. We need to look for breakthrough points and places that we can just kind of take out their ports, stuff like that, and try to get back some medium tanks. Holy crap. We need to instantly just start moving up. The German war machine, physically, on the land portion of this is okay. In the air, we're dead. Like, they have absolute air superiority. Navy, they just, you don't even talk about the German Navy, it just doesn't exist. Oh, if we could take Dunkirk, oh yeah, oh yeah, that's good. Oh, what is, what are they doing? I mean, I mean, this is good for us, but, uh, what the, what, 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 where are their soldiers? All right, er, in the end of, the end of the last episode, this was so hard. But, now they put no soldiers up here, I mean... Are they going to, like, navally invade somewhere else? Because basically, now Belgium's dead. We've literally taken all the ports that they needed to reinforce their soldiers. But, uh... They're not here. Can they pierce me? I bet they can. Oh, they can. Nice! Give me... Army XP Organizer. This guy, Simmons, is an organizer as well. Oh, shit. What the fuck happened? I mean, I guess just hold, that guy will hold the line. Simmons. We're gonna need someone to guard the port as well. Uh, send you this way. Just take the tanks. We're extremely injured. Uh, go like right there or something and just like focus on that province, maybe? Or at least hold the pro Oh, well, they're, they're, I found them. They're down here. It's definitely giving us some more army XP, and they can pierce the tank. Oh! Oh, shit. Oh, shit. That's not good. That's not good. Get out. Get out. Get out. Get out. Don't lose the division. Don't lose that 40 with the vision. Oh, I'm going to lose the 40 with the vision. I'm going to lose it. I lost it. Oh, my God. Holy fuck. I lost every single tank in that division. I'm gonna might even lose this one. Holy shit. Oh my god. Like, how is that even possible? How is that even possible? They literally murdered an entire 40 width tank division. What the fuck is going on? That That's just broken. That's absolutely broken. Now I don't have any, really any tanks. Oh my god. Oh, and you just don't have the industry for a massive war effort. I'm gonna take you off. Put you on. Ooh. Probably decrease that by one. Advanced anti artillery. Definitely need a lot of planes. Oh, they still have this province, so they're still getting some supplies. That's not good. Shit. Fuck, I can't believe I lost an entire tank division. That's insane. That is e extremely insane. Ooh, look. You best be holding out here. Here in Danzig. You best not lose that boy. Not this core Polish territory. Ooh, maritime patrol, good. Um, 1943. Already producing a lot of this, which is good. I need more factories. I just need literally more factories. Let's get some more uh, artillery. Oh, let's take, just take one division and plop them right there. We should be able to hold that out. Uh, the south is probably doing okay. 
Oh my god. What's wrong with this? 10% manpower? Italy. Italy. You're out of manpower already. Oh my god. This is so bad. Oh! But at least we got these. Alright, I'm gonna just instantly convert you. Because at this point, there's no loss, really, to converting them. Oh, well, except for that. Army modernization, anti tank. Uh, we can probably build our naval stuff up. Is anyone getting invaded? Western Balkans? No, oh, they should be able to hold that pretty easy. Ooh, this is. Not good. I mean, Germany. Leave it to the Germans to declare war on Bul oh, not Bulgaria, but Belgium. I was doing so well. I should not have joined the Axis. Oh my good lord. Oh, they got the port. Fuck! Fuck! <sighs> they got the port back. Yeah, screw that. We need a brand new army. We're going to have, to have a, like, a line of defense because France is coming back. I need you to be strategically placed right here. And I need you to cut these people off. Screw the tanks, screw everything else. Or, you know, their tanks or whatever. We have to take this province. Do as many encirclements as humanly possible. To even have a chance of winning. No, you got to win. For Oh my god, you just take forever to do anything. Oh my god, yeah, France. Oh, we made an encirclement down here. That's always kind of nice. Holding up very well down there. Oh my god, this is really aggravating. Extremely aggravating. I was doing so well. And then Germany just fucks it up. Belgians, how much man more manpower do you have? I mean, my God. Um, I need to put that soldier back over there. Are these guys linked up? They best not be. Well, that's that's that eight. These are this four. Western Poland's getting invaded. That's not good. Go, 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 go! You have tanks, I know they have air superiority. Oh, this is no- yeah, just don't even attack. Don't even. There's no point. We need so many tanks, it's not even funny. Yeah, let's take these guys out. This division, this horse division could probably take them out. Yeah, take them out. Take them out. Screw them. Screw the Belgians. You guys, they should be dying. We're just hopefully holding the line. That's all I want to do. Just hold the line. Hold every line you can. If there's a line, you should hold it. Hold it in your hand. I thought the German war machine would be better than this. They were so good at taking out the enemies. Manpower. Hmm. We need to increase conscription levels eventually. But fighting the entire world pretty much is not easy. It's a I guess that's why Germany lost in real life. Because <sighs> this shit is not easy. And come on, Italy, please, get some manpower. Belgium, I think, was just like stocking up on everything here. Expanded royal powers, and eh, that doesn't really affect military stuff. Population, tank destroyers. I'm just hoping to make more tanks. Please don't screw it up for us. I beg you, Germany, because if Germany loses, I'm done as well. I mean, we are just D-E-A-D. -E D-E-A-D. Alright, so everything seems pretty stable at this point. Not too much has been moving around. Italy continues to lose their soldiers. <sighs> Italy. The UK, though, is a piece of garbage. Just a piece of garbage. I would love to make an encirclement, but at this point, 
That does not seem likely. Just... We're just biding time to get, pretty much at this point to get to, get to nukes. And you know, it, when the United States declares war on Germany, it's going to be over. It's literally all going to be over. So we got to get to nukes ASAP. And we lost that province. It's just, I don't understand how they can do this so well. It's probably because they're using 40 width divisions. Most of the time, I'm just using 20 width. I really don't want to attack. I suppose I can help them out a little bit. Ooh, we got a little bit more power now. So we had a little bit of armor, which helps a little bit. But infantry or cavalry? Air superiority is extremely good. Get more attack, more defense. If we're on defense... Oh, but this will give us defense regardless. Attack, that gives even more defense. Hmm. Ships don't matter. They won't matter. Better fighters. That matters a lot. Navy, air reformer, air superiority, justification of war, that won't matter. Anything I can do for my decisions? Improve worker conditions? Oh, send combat reports to the fighter manufacturers. Get research bonus to fighters, light bombers, bombers, naval planes, that's actually extremely cool. But let's just go ahead and take the infantry defense. Actually, cavalry. Cavalry, but infantry. Which right now I have a lot of infantry, but they're not doing anything. But I have cavalry, and my cavalry, six divisions of cavalry, as well as guarding ports, is good for defense as well. Let's do that. I think that's actually a really good idea. I'm actually using cavalry for once in my actual gameplays. Nice. That's good. You should be getting a lot of experience. You really should be. That's not good up there. Is there any place that we could just break through? No. Alright then. Divisions down there. Honestly, I'm just waiting to get more tanks. I mean, that's really the game we're playing right now, as well as more planes, of course. Let's see. Resources. We need more oil and rubber and tungsten and steel. And we just need more fighters. We need more rubber and fighters. So let's get some more rubber. rubber, slightly more rubber, and let's get some more of this, followed by, can we increase, we can increase this, that's good, but this won't really help us too much, so let's do that, do that, do that, Sarabia, Slovenia, down here, and I don't any own any provinces over this side, darn it, this is a lot of red, that's not good. We're just going to play the defense game. Let's let them let them continue it to attack Germany. I hope your manpower is okay. I really okay. It seems to be okay. 1.7 million right now. Is, that's pretty good. Just don't attack too much. I don't want you to lose too many guys. Maybe I should make bigger cavalry divisions. If I do this. They need more motorized, more logistics. Engineers. Oh, yeah. Why don't I have engineers on them? They definitely need engineers on them. They absolutely need it. Just defend. Just defend. Yeah, that's good. That is not good. Oh, God. Go that direction. That's not good. 40 with the tank divisions are going to be, and as well as their superiority, well, it's going to win the war for us, probably. If you could help them move in here faster, that would actually be pretty good. Well, well, shipping building, import, study, destroyers, subs would probably be better right now, because they'll probably all get destroyed regardless if I build destroyers. One civilian factory or anti-tank gun, that's not useful. Plus air support, naval bombers, heavy fighters... Air Doctrine. Ah, let's go with close air support next. Nice. Let the tanks lead the way. Hmm. Ooh, now we have a new army. Good, we're gonna need this army. Maybe almost immediately. Now where'd that army go? You're right here. 
You're doing a good job holding out. Um, where would I put you? Oh, actually, you know, I would have put you. Put you right here. And like normal, I'm going to need a new commander. Poland, you, you really should have had more commanders during the war. Come on, have more tanks come in. I don't mind using my horses to help attack, though. That's okay. Yeah, yeah, let the German armor move in. Uh, or And then leave immediately. Oh, we have, wait, we have air, air support. What? When's when? Three, three. Oh, yeah, we're going to need better anti-air. Uh, when do we get air su superiority? What? Oh, someone invading? Alright, well, looks like we're going to win that battle. Um, wow, when, when do we get air superiority? Ooh, they took Dunkirk, which is not good. Go ahead and move in as well. Good. Keep it. Can't give him any more supplies. Luxembourg is getting it. Jesus Christ, Germany, what the hell are you doing? Don't waste all your supplies. Equipment is valuable. It's extremely valuable. Send in some Italians. They'll die down here. Probably. The French are back. Again, and again, and again. Defense of freedom. You're not free. No, no, no. You're ruled by a dictator. So don't lie to the world saying you're fighting for the free world. Oh my god, that's terrible. Look at this. Oh, that's like, that's actually not bad. Because they have no supplies and they're, all, they're dead. Oh. Jeez, this game gets me so excited sometimes. Jesus. Portuguese. Yeah, this war is not done very much. Actually, I forgot to look at this last time. Oh, God, look at the Raj. They took out all of this. The Raj is disgusting. It looks like they have like a mutated arm. But Japan is doing okay against China with Mongolia helping them out. If we could have Japan also declare war on like the Soviet Union or the Allies, I mean, that would probably help out quite a bit. Just don't go to war with the Philippines or anything like that. Please do not. Nice. We're not budging so far. Oh, oh yeah, we'll probably win that one. Just good. Our deficit is negative 1.5 thousand. Actually, you know what? We need reinforcements to be number one, so take you guys off. Or at least lower their support. We need, in the field, better soldiers. Alright. 555 tanks are needed. And we've got nowhere close to that. Oh no, my planes. Did they all die as well? Oh, they're down here. Well, let's put you somewhere closer. Oh, you're only 300 planes here. So 300 planes. Oh, I could put you up there. That'd be good. Alright. So the lines are being held. I don't have enough decryption to figure out how many soldiers they have, which is really quite unfortunate. Got a couple planes in reserve. Oh boy. Oh, that's a lot of planes. How can you not shoot them down? Any new invasions? Oh, is our defense game on point? Oh, oh, oh. Send you this down here immediately. Just in case. Alright. Oh, Good. So defense... I said this last time and I was wrong. But looks like, it just looks like, we're doing okay. We're holding out. Not too many things are going wrong yet, again. Oh, they will eventually, though. They definitely will go wrong eventually. We three better engineers could be good. Land doctrine is good to be done. Air doctrine, we three. Engineering, we four. Oh, yeah, let's get some nuclear reactors. We gotta start. We gotta get nukes. Which means we have to get air superiority. Which means we'll probably never use nukes. Oh, wow, we're getting bombed pretty heavily, it seems like. Interception's good. They try to attack both sides of the war losing no it's mostly just my side that well, I guess no one's losing attrition for now I've lost quite a few guys not as much as Poland did historically but uh until you lose a third of your entire country's population uh, I'm nowhere near the casualty rate so 
So far so good. We're holding very, very well, and this is looking gonna look terrifying. You know what? Just in case, maybe I should add some more forts. Oh, I did add I added a lot of forts. Hmm, have some more fallback lines. Eventually this will be good. Maybe down there. Yeah, this is a pretty extensive fort system. For some day. Let's see, is there anything else? Uh let's see. Let's do that, but let's also build up some more oil and rubber. And they get more military factories. That'll be good. We're still building a little bit of radar. Construction went up, so we can build things even faster. That's good. That's getting better. Yeah, this is getting better and better. To be more self-sufficient. Resource efficiency gain. That's good. Don't use really any anti-tank yet. Uh, let's wait for that. We've got other things we could use. Infantry, leg infantry, engineer companies. Less reliability is not good. Steel. Uh, let's see. Dive bomber fighter agility goes down, but more fighter range. Tank defense, breakthrough. Uh, something that everyone could use is probably better engineers. <clears throat> let's go with that. It would be good to be on the defense. I don't want to take too many casualties. Come on, guys. Why, why aren't you attacking again? You don't you don't like losing that many guys? Come on. Come on now. What if we just hold these guys out for a little bit and then act like we're going somewhere else? I guess we're going to do that instead. All right. They're just biding time. That's all they're doing. We need to have some sort of strike that could kill something. But no, uh, we can't do any strike because tanks. I can't believe I got myself into this type of mess. I can't believe at one point we own this port in Vlandern. Vlandern? Vlandern. Oh, Vlandern. <sighs> Good times. Good times. Got quite an extensive fort system here. Not as good as the Maginot line, but... Still pretty darn good. Especially with a couple forts behind the actual provinces themselves. Let's see. Fighter manufacturers... Active 450 days, a little bit of research bonus, fighters. Am I doing the fighter one? No, I'm not. Just so many guys here. Is, um, what's going on? What if we went up here? Ooh, anti air upgrade, I like it. Get some better anti-air going now. I really don't want to try push at all, just because I'm gonna lose so many guys, and Poland can't really do that very well. Support companies. Ooh. I'll also do that. Come on, Germany, do something. Germany, I'm holding the line against the Soviets, even though I know I, I caused the problem. Should be able to do something here. More than faced, pasted, wasted, failed attacks on this little area. How many divisions do they have? They have oh ten. They've got ten divisions down there. That's not good. Didn't I have close air support around here? I'm holding up there for now. Oh, oh there's there, there's my close air support. that by another hundred or so. Let's 
get the tanks ready to go, and then we'll push on out. Oh, or not, or not, or not, or not. Uh. Well then. Oh, don't. Oh my god. Uh, playing defense is so hard as this country. You know, you thought Poland was hard early on, and if you survive, you're like, oh, this is pretty good. If you choose one side, but then... Oh, wait. I don't want that one. I want, uh... Yeah, better air superiority. Nope. Germany, go push, 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 push in. Yeah, go ahead and push in with the Italians. That'd be good. Yeah, take it. Take it. Push, push them in. Our goal is to get to the port. We're not losing anything there, so that's good. Let's see. Where am I? Oh, come on. I said everyone come over here. I wonder what was taking them so long. They're not even over here. We need that province. Alright. Hey, Dana, nice. You overran a couple divisions. Good job, German armor. Oh, they have a lot of armor. I'm not going to attack until I have my armor up here ready to go as well. Oh yeah, attack me. Come on, German armor. Can you, can you attack the Lorient, perhaps? Oh, you did. Nice. Jesus Christ. Oh, they even took the breast. Uh, no, you need those divisions. Even though, actually, it'd probably be better for me to own the divisions and tell them where to go instead of Italy, but whatever. But whatever. Oh, good. Oh. Two more tanks, that's okay. Honestly, we could probably stop making these tanks now. Because I just want real tanks. You know what? Just make one at a time. No, make two at a time. That sounds good. We have how many? Six. So I'll need 18, so really nine series. So keep that to medium. You eight will join... I don't know, it doesn't really matter. This group? Yeah. I'll pull the line. And let's put you new commander. Oh, uh, the, oh well, okay. Communist China is gone. But, who's currently leading these tanks? Simmons? Well, you are interesting, Simmons, and you better plenty in air superiority, but I must put you under this guy. You, not you. You. Be under this guy. Good. Antoni. Antoni. Antony. Good. Now, how many more garrison divisions do we need? Eight. Oh, we only need 18. Let's put that there as well. Good. I hope the Soviets keep attacking down here, but I don't think they have been. I don't think they have been. Really quite unfortunate. Alright, air modernization, quit India movement. I like that. I uh, might as well get that next. I hope Raj... Oh, oh, that sucks. Strengthen ties with British investors. Well, that sucks. Can't use them as a... a way for Britain to be distracted by them. Alright. Three still. Hmm. Logistics. Recon could be good. Tanks. Air. Ah, let's go ahead and go with that. How's our construction going? Going alright. Looks like we're almost done with a couple refineries, maybe a few uh, factories are getting there. That's good. Definitely will need more steel, though. Yeah, maybe I should make some more civilian factories, actually. Yeah, that would be good, actually, to do. Do I have any divisions down here yet? Come on, guys. Oh, there's only 16 of you. Um, well then. That's not good. That leaves this pocket open. Before we leave, let us take... Uh, take... 
two of you and just mm, be added to this group. We will also need a garrison in this area. And that's that'll be good. And we'll end this episode here. So guys, uh, it's been a lot more panic. Just so much defense right now, it's not even funny. Germans have lost nearly 2 million guys. The British need to lose more. Yeah, so I hope you enjoyed it, guys. Um, Maybe I'll just play a little bit ahead of time to see what will happen, if anything's different than, other than that. So, Guys, hope you enjoyed this episode. Hope you leave a like. Hope you subscribe. And I hope to see you in the next one. Thank you for watching.